Welcome to Matthew Kellett Photography and uh, today we're, we're going to be doing a time lapse in a, a hop garden. Um, I'm doing a video at the moment, a short film about hop, hop growing and what it's like in Kent and Sussex. And uh, this time of year it's spring, everything's growing really fast and I'm going to be doing time lapses of the hop grind vines growing all the way up to the top. Oh look, it's a ladybird. <clears throat> right, quickly, uh, here is my time lapse at the moment of a um, growth tip spinning its way around the hop vines. Um, I'm using a radon, which is a uh, very popular panning and tilting time lapse device, which is normally plugged to a DSLR. You alternatively can use time lapse remote or one on your phone or on the GoPro or whatever. It's, but this gives a bit of movement and it's quite good fun. Right, all we have here is a simple time lapse device, but um, you can use anything. GoPro, mobile phone, anything you want really. But uh, here we go. All you need really is a tripod. Uh, this is a radon, very cool device from America. You can still get hold of them and you can get hold if you go onto their website, um, alpinelabs.com. Put it in the link below. Again, any old digital camera and a mobile phone. Uh, as I said, you can do time lapses with absolutely anything these days. Phones, you know, they all have built in devices. So it's relatively straightforward. So, well, before we do a time lapse, um, we need to set up our tripod. So, most important thing is to uh, use this little spirit level, use these dial ones, put it on the center, and move the tripod so it's nice. Tripod. And we put the little device on. Set in. Find your composure. Find your composition. With this device, there's an app, so it's uh, controlled off, off, um, off your phone. New app or a new time-lapse, we're going to go for a counterclockwise small pan of this field, it's panning from right to left, just in front here. Um, so yeah, composition's all set up, set the focus, right this one um, is going to be set for um, counterclockwise 30 degrees for half an hour uh, every five seconds. I'm going to load it. So it's preloading now and it's set to go. Now all you have to do is sit back and wait for your time lapse to finish. Right, the um, time lapse is complete. Little device on my phone tells me it's complete, so yeah. With any luck, that should have been quite a nice time lapse. Look into it, it's interesting, and uh, it can be quite good fun to, well, an effective way of making uh, images move and get into video. That's how I got into video, so yeah. Cheers, bye.